Leah, what's going on? Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today I'm going to do your love spread for the month of March. And that's for all Leos, uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And if there are any cross watchers, you're more than welcome to watch. But make sure that you keep in mind that these energies can be flipped. Let's take a look, Leo. What is going on? between you and the person on your mind what's the general energy here okay general energy between two of you and we have three of swords leo why so i feel like there have been a really uh painful heartbreak here and it's definitely very heavy energy here it's not just a little thing it definitely feels very big so let's take a look at how they view you here. How do they view you? How do they view you, Leo? They view you as someone who is distracted, someone who is not focused, someone who doesn't have priorities straight. Hmm. Let's take a look at how you view them. How do you view them? How do you view them? How do you view them, Leo? How do you view them? You view them as someone who is not interested in what you have to offer. You feel like they are rejecting you here a little bit. Oh, let's clarify this Three of Swords energy, Leo. What happened? What happened? Three of Swords. Let's clarify that. What happened with Three of Swords energy here? What's going on? Three of Swords. Clarify that. Clarify three of swords. Death. Whew. So you had a painful ending with this person, but I want to know why. I really want to know why. What happened here? Why did you have to break up? Why did you have to end this connection, this relationship that ended in such a painful heartbreak? Why? Why did you have to break up? And we have two cards. Oof. Someone wasn't putting uh someone wasn't putting enough work into this connection and also juggling things here. So with the two of pentacles in the upright position and the three of swords in the upright position, I know that it's not gonna talk to everybody, but for some portion of you it could uh, indicate a third party connection here so someone must have been having uh, must have been um, having their options open so yeah that's not cool Leo I'm so sorry let's take a look at your person and see their possible future plans towards you what's the possible future actions that they are going to take towards you possible future actions towards leo possible future actions towards leo please possible future actions so we have three cards that flew out and we have oh wow leo they are <laughs> if you are not communicating with this person right now and i doubt you are <laughs> because of what happened they are playing planning on that communication i feel like they had some time away from you but they really do realize now that they do want to communicate with you they do want to come forward with some kind of little message i wouldn't expect a lot i would expect maybe something that is completely uh something very small like a text message something that doesn't really they're not going to be very straightforward here but they are lowering their guard down they're coming out of that hermit um you know energy they're really trying to take action here so let's take a look at your possible uh outcome with that person leo What's going on between you and the person on your mind? Possible outcome between two of you. Possible outcome. Wow. These cards are very active today. 
so this is awesome i feel like this is an amazing read for you leos so the possible outcome here that i feel like someone is just not gonna be able to move past the issues that have happened between two of you with the tower in reverse and the five of cups in reverse i feel like they're really uh it's too much to ask it's too much to ask i feel like they want to they want to move past or you want to move past but it's it's definitely extremely difficult and keep in mind that this outcome may change just because energies are always changing so it's not set in stone but right now with these energies it doesn't look like you guys are going to be able to move forward here okay and with the nine of pentacles in the reverse position here i feel like you're really gonna kind of stop paying attention at them as much i feel like you're really kind of gonna try to uh withdraw from them a little bit so let's take a look at their hidden truth oracle message here what would they want to tell you if they were completely honest if they were completely honest what would they want to say and it says i hide behind material things so they're really trying to um keep you out of their head what's the advice from spirit guides here we have increased awareness and it says deep connection trust your inner voice always trust your inner voice trust your intuition one more advice we have a win-win outcome is forecast well whatever's gonna happen here whatever outcome is is for the better that's what i can see so one more advice from spirit guides and we have snake and it says be sensitive to your healing abilities towards yourself and others i feel like you guys have that ability to help people and really know how to um, heal some things when it comes to you as well so right now i want you to ask spirit guides a yes or no question and we are going to pull an answer for you okay I want you to concentrate, focus, center yourself. If you need to pause the video, you can pause the video and I'll pull the answer for you. So the answer to your question is, your answer is in the cards. Whatever that means, you guys. So the answer is in the cards. Um... I hope this was a little bit helpful, Leos. I'm so sorry about this heartbreak and I hope you do all well. And I will talk to you later. Take care. Bye.